All right, so you're going to drill a hole two inches up from the bottom, from the center. Uh, and you're going to use a one and a half paddle bit to drill this hole. This is where this would go. So you're going to go ahead, assemble all of this, put all of this together, put this in here, this here. You're going to put the cement glue on. This piece here will go in as such. This will screw in on the other side. You don't need any uh, PVC cement with this. The, the rubber gasket is enough to keep the water at bay. So I drilled a hole here at the top. And then you drill another hole here. Okay, and you would take this, route it through here, route that through there, and bend it down so it doesn't, and you're done with this side. Um, I also would put some some silicone here I could use a, a one inch paddle bit to cut my hole right um, I'm using this ball cock, this piece is adjustable. So when you get it, when you take it out of the package, this won't be on there. You have to screw this piece on. You take this, flip it upside down, right? Tighten it up, right? And when you assemble it inside here, it's going to be this way, okay? You're gonna assemble it this way. So that when the water rises, it hits this stopper and it cuts off the water flow. All right. So this would go in here. This part would go in here. And you don't need any cement. It already has a gasket on it. Put this on. Real simple. Not much to it. Uh, the other two pieces that you're going to need to connect is this piece. Put this on. So it's hand tighten. That's it. This piece here, uh, you can get. It's a um, a dishwasher connector, um, and that connects straight to a water hose right and so the piece that comes with this you would take this off and you would screw this on and that's all there is to it 